Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, this is actually pre-recorded. I pre-recorded this on Tuesday, which will be up Wednesday for you guys. This is going to be a makeup look on the makeup look that I wore to the doctor yesterday. And for a disclaimer, I am so sorry that I did not film a vlog for yesterday and I just updated it, done the life update. With the doctor's appointments, there is a lot going on right now. So, um, I was just more concerned about the appointment and everything. I really hope you guys can understand that. But, yes, this is going to be the makeup look that I wore yesterday to the doctor and everything like that so yes if you guys are new to my channel please be sure to subscribe it would mean the absolute world to me and click the little bell to be notified when I upload excuse me and Michelle if you are watching this I had a blast running into you yesterday it was so crazy that we met up yesterday without planning it I guess <laughs> and um, I'm in her vlog she was vlogging when she seen me yesterday and I was just so excited so I love you Michelle and I love your videos and your channel I've been binge watching all day and I have a lot of them saved to my phone just to watch all the time so yes without me blabbing on anymore I'm going to just jump right on into this makeup tutorial. Okay, so to start off this look, I'm going to do my eyebrows and I'll just show you guys what I've done for them. I just went in with this Addiction 2 palette of mine I've had for years. And this is a Real Techniques brow brush. And I just went in with this brown shade called Cocky right here. And just fill them in like so. This is going to be like my summer one where I talk about my products and stuff. I don't go too crazy with filling them in. So yeah, it's not the best, but it's not the worst. So yeah so the doctor's appointment was all right I still have to hydrate more than everything So, yeah, that's pretty much the gist of it. Um, I'm trying not to rub that off, but um, I'm going to do make this like a little chit chat makeup tutorial type thing. But, um, yeah, um, just to chat with you guys about what's going on. Um, I go back to the doctor again Thursday. This Thursday so yeah um, I'm hoping for good news um, they said if I was not where they still want me to be for like hydrating wise then I would have to consider possibly having a early delivery which is really scary because right now she is only four pounds and one ounce, so she would be a preemie. 
and um she's healthy and everything it's me they're concerned about just like i told joseph and my mom i'm hydrating and hydrating it just seems like it's not enough still like this whole weekend i drank like a 12 pack of gatorade and water and it still isn't where they want me to be so hoping everything will go fine and everything so yeah that's pretty much what the doctor's appointment was about yesterday on monday so anyway i am going in with this revlon color stay pressed powder in light slash medium um i just quickly used just the sponge that came with it yesterday and just patted it all over like this <laughs> this was just something really light on my skin so that's what I done yesterday because it was so hot yesterday So yeah, I just quickly put that all over. Just nothing too crazy. And so the next thing I just went in with was I went ahead and done my eyes. And I went in with this LA Colors 5 color matte eyeshadow palette in purple cashmere. Just looks like this. And I just went in with this lightest shade first on a fluffy brush. Tap some off and just got a good base going. Sorry for that quick little pause. I was texting Joseph Beck. So the next thing I did was I went in with just this little blending brush here. It's a smaller blending brush. And I went in with this dark purple right here. I just kind of packed it on. Tapped some off. And placed this right in the crease as you can see And if I wanted to darken it up a little bit, I would just add a little bit more, tap it off, and just slowly build that color up, just so I don't have a ton of shadow to have to blend. Okay, so I went ahead and done the other eye off of camera because I want to save a little bit of time. So after I got done with that, I just went in with a flatter brush like this. And I just went in with this light lavender purple. And just packed that bad boy on the brush. And placed it all over my lid. Now there are a few 
products that I'm adding in that I didn't wear with it because I had to obviously wear a mask so I didn't see the point in it but yes there are a few products that I'm adding in that I did not have on the other day so I'm just going to blend the eyeshadow out like so now I went in with this product here it was the LA colors jumbo eye pencil and if you watch Michelle's channel, you know that she has the same one. It won't focus, but it says it's in the shade Sunglasses. And I just tugged my eyelid down. And done my bottom waterline. Like so. So the next thing I went in with was this... LA Colors Graphics Eyeliner I got gave to me the other day. It is in... I have no idea. I'm looking for the name. I'm half blind. I don't know, but it's purple. And I just do this on my top waterline. I didn't do a wing or nothing, so I'm going to do this off camera just to save a ton of time okay so the eyeliner is done like I said I didn't do any wing or anything like that um, I did go in with some blush though um, my mom got this gave to her the other day so I used it it is the L'Oreal Paris infallible paints blush palette and it looks like this and I just went in with this really light, like, peachy shade on this little brush right here. It doesn't have a name or nothing. So I just put some on the brush. Smiled. like that this is actually a new product for me um, I really really wanted to use it for this look I would have used it if I already had it but I got it yesterday it is the LA colors highlight in shine bright it has never been on the package obviously so this is like a first impressions this is like a video that's all over the place so so excited okay still getting it open just look at it I will do a little swatch for you guys. Just look. So, um, yes, I'm just going to go in with that same angle brush and just sweep across the highlight. And highlight where I normally would. I love how like subtle it is. I 
I'm adding a little to my chin where I am draw and I like to accentuate my forehead a little really brightening up the cheeks where this eye is so dark overall I really really like it it's very very gorgeous and the last thing I'm going to do is add a lip to this. I did not add a lip yesterday, but I'm going to, this time I'm going in with my LA Colors High Shine Shea Butter Lip Gloss in Baby Cakes. It's just a really light pink nude. And this stuff smells so, so, so good. I did have this in my purse though to put on. I just never did. So now I'm going to show you guys with my hair down the whole look. final look as you guys seen in the previous clips oh my god I totally forgot to add mascara but anyway I did add mascara I just totally forgot to put it on I just used the Too Faced Better Than Sex mascara um but yeah huh. I just completely forgot to put it on so yeah this is the final look. I really hope you guys enjoyed it, and I will see you in my next video. Bye!